yeah. this movement? So I, um, I, I hated my body and I hated how my body looked and I thought the only alternative for me was to have surgery <clears throat> to fix my body. After and, delivery? Yeah, after kids. having three kids. Mm. And um, I was going to have the surgery, but then I had this epiphany, which was how am I going to teach my daughter to love her body if I can't love my body? Mm. So I cancelled the surgery, but I was still thinking, oh, I, I want to know what it feels like to have the bikini body that mm. so many women mm. have, and I wanted. Um, so I trained and I got it, and um, it actually didn't make me happy. Mm. It made me quite grumpy. Mm. <laughs> Food restriction, uh, constant obsession, dieting, worrying about calories in, calories out. Mm. It just didn't make me a very happy, connected person. Mm. Mm. So I think for me it was receiving those 7,000 emails and messages from women all across the world, mm. sharing how they felt about their bodies and their sad stories mm. and how miserable they felt. I just knew, knew that I needed to do something more with this information and um, tell my story and then tell many other stories as well. Mm. And that's what happens when we share our stories. Mm. We give one another hope. Mm. And that's exactly what's happened with Embrace. This yeah, I do. I, I, I want to speak and connect with more people in Japan because I know it's a very big issue and in particular for women. Mm. A lot of women hate their bodies. A lot of women are dieting. Mm. A lot of women are trying to change their skin colour. A lot of women are having cosmetic surgery. Mm. And I, I want the Embrace message to be heard by them. I want you to know that there's an alternative. Mm. Um, you don't have to battle against your body. Mm. And I'm hoping also that I can I can get out there soon and mm. someone can train translate my words um, mm -hmm. into Japanese so you know I can share this goodness um, mm -hmm. with women who are tired of hating their bodies mm -hmm. and want to learn how to love them. Mm -hmm. Have you been to Japan? No, but so I want to. <laughs> <laughs> I so really I'm want to. Next year. Next year. I think next year means 2019. 2019, yes. correct.